I think number one, the absolutely most important thing uh, is to protect your confidence. Um, you, you really have to believe you're a writer. There'll be plenty of people out there within the industry uh, and within your own productions that will challenge and question and criticize your work. So you have to really remember why you wrote it, uh, that you are a writer as your identity and that you have the confidence to stand behind everything you've done. In terms of craft, writing with a stopwatch is a wonderful thing. I suggest to everyone, create a file on your computer called Write Rubbish um, and get a stopwatch by yourself, by your uh, table. And every time you go to write in the mornings, in the evenings, in the afternoons, whenever it is, give yourself very short amounts of time. So 20 seconds, a minute, two minutes, five minutes, and just force yourself to just keep writing. Just destroy the distance between yourself and the page so that you can really sort of start kind of mining some interesting stuff and it doesn't matter what you write it can be total 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 nonsense uh, which leads actually on to another tip which I think is very important is that it has to be okay to write total total rubbish um, if you start getting yourself in a situation where you're feeling that every word has to be honed and good and, and reader ready um, then you're going you're going to kind of hamstring yourself. So you, you have to feel you can write without it being writing that other people are going to read. So do lots of writing when no one is looking. Uh, writing a play is very different to writing uh, a book or a poem or something like that because it's structurally very different. Um, I suppose fiction authors and poets would tell you that structure is a huge part, uh, structure and craft, and it's the same for theatre. Playwriting is written, uh, is spelt W R. I-G-H-T rather than W-R-I-T-E because it's not writing so much, this is something somebody told me, uh, as to rot. So it's sort of the same way that you would make uh, iron or something like that. So it's bending and shaping uh, as much as it is writing. And there's a real um, engineering sort of aspect to it that you have to have a good sense of, of structure and timing and shape. Um, and when I'm writing a play, it's it's very much about pinning down the kind of the underlying foundations that you can then really exercise your kind of writerly flair on top of.